All right, so now that we have um, both of our issues set up in iTunes, we need to now set up those two issues in our app as well and also in our, and the way we do that is going to be by setting up the issues in our sample JSON file. That's in the JSON file that the app connects to. So here is a, um, so here are two issues that I want to actually upload into my app. So the first one is basically a, uh, this, the, the second one, let's start with the second one, is a PDF file, um, which actually um, displays my issues. Um, it has multiple pages, and this is actually these are actually the pages of my magazine. So basically, you can create your magazine using PDFs or HTML. So this is the first um, way of doing that. Um, so in this case, we have a PDF file. And in the, issue, in the case of issue one, we have a series of web pages a series of HTML pages so this is the first HTML page right and um, this and then there are other HTML pages actually in this in this list so basically um, to set up the HTML pages we need to zip up all the files right and um, what the application is going to do is um, it's going to Create or I mean, it's going to actually extract all these files and display them in order in alphabetical order. So if you want a page to show up as the first one, you, you have to actually either make it alphabetical or you can easily number them. So if I do zero one here, for example, and then zero two, so this HTML page is going to show up as the first page of my magazine. I think you understand what I mean by that. All right, okay, so. I'm going to zip all this up, so I'm going to select everything, then I'm going to say compress 19 items. This is very important, right? Um, do not zip, so if I go one level higher, right, we have the folder here, do not zip the folder or else it's not going to work. So we need you to zip the files directly in here. So I've zipped that and then that's in the archive.zip, and then I'm going to paste that here. So this is going to be my issue, issue one. Okay, so now I'm going to actually upload this to the server, upload these two issues to the server here. So I'm going to drag and drop this to the server on App Design Vault. That's the first one. I'm going to replace that. And also the second one is um, issue 4.pdf. Alright, so that's the first one, and then this is the second one. Alright, so that's the that's um, basically uploading the issues to a server. So now we need to point our JSON files to those locations. So here we have um, the JSON file again. We have two issues. That's the first one, and then that's the second one in here. And then two things we want to do is um, set the content URL to issue1.zip. That's the file I just uploaded. And then the content URL, and then the content URL for the second one is um, issue4.pdf. That's the second one which I uploaded. Another thing which you also want to do is upload your cover image URL. So that's what's going to show up on the front page of the magazine. So I have these two images in here. So I have that. Let me show you how that looks like. So if I paste that in there. So that's the cover image for the second um, for the second um, issue. All right. Okay. So the next step is to open our export project, go to our configuration.plist and then make sure that this issue configuration location actually points to our JSON file. So now let's upload the JSON file as well to the server. So we have that server there and then we're going to drag this and then drop that on in the server. You can use FTP, you can use whatever method you want, right? So now that's the location of my JSON file. I'm just going to copy that and then paste that here just so you can see the so we have this um the same information here all right so that's basically the um how to set up the issues in the magazine and these are the same issues or these are the same this is the same information that i have on itunes connect and then you just basically start and then run your simulator so this can run the i um the application on the ipad retina simulator I'm going to click run here. Okay, so then we have those two issues in here, right? 
so now you should be able to start downloading the issues right so by clicking on any of the issues but then the application will want you to subscribe to um to, to subscribe to the magazine before you can do this you can either have a paid or free sub subscription so before we download that we're gonna have to actually connect our in-app purchases as well in the next video i'm going to show you how to connect your subscriptions to the magazine all right thank you for listening watch out for the next video